Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Hold on. Is he... dead? Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now just hold on a damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you the kind of leader you are. They're not gonna make it much longer. And you're kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is gonna solve anything. Now, you may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl. Which is why I'm gonna make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. What you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. somewhere yeah I'm about to head out I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything it's been fun that might be for the best boats gonna be crowded as it is and you kind of strike me as more of a go it alone type yeah I've always had a hard time relying on other people although I've got to admit you've given me a reason to rethink that Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Hey, sweet pea. Henny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do, after he fixes it? Where will we go? 
Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. I guess you're worried about him, too. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Sure. We'll look before we leave. Really? You'll take me to Crawford so we can look? <sighs> I knew you didn't really mean it. Clementine? 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 Clementine! Oh, God. Lee? Lee? You out here? Lee! Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's his. Look at his arm. He, he's been bitten. He's bitten! Oh my god. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. Holy shit. And Vernon ain't here anymore. Did he take her? I don't know. But I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? I don't know what to do here. I don't even know if I can ask for your help. Lee, we're a team. That's how we've made it this far. We're not going to just abandon you. 